All right, match 12 in the FPT Arena Season 3 Single Class Challenge AI Tournament. It's going to be now between Soundcaster on top and Vanvalet on bottom. So for Soundcaster, he has a team of Time Mages comprised of Jasmine, <coughs> Diana, uh, Lei Lanai, <coughs> and Paul. All right, so to briefly go over this team, we saw Germany... Or uh, Gate Buster 202 cover this team. This is a dual wield in Time Age with some degree of magic. Comet, I think, raising Asuna. Ghost Dav is nice to get rid of the um, positive buffs on the enemy on the enemy team. And Rainbow Staff is nice just to protect yourself from oil. Combat boosters you can just get in range a little bit. That's always nice. This is a uh, super fast stats inflict in Time Age. Um, I want to say she has Steel Heart. I know she has Quickening, uh, with H move HP up on all potion, short charge, and just annoys the hell out of you. This is a summon magic time age, particularly with Sylph, Shiva, and Odin. Uh, Odin would, you know, uh, you know, can can probably trigger the death proc, and if that hits, that's bad news for the opponent. And of course, this is a very anti-elemental uh, support time age here um, for. Soundcaster, as these three lays have all best compat with him, so short charge raise twos are pretty much a guarantee. Um, so yeah, that's pretty much all there is to it here. Mates Zoo is just there simply to absorb lightning, nothing else. Uh, yeah, too bad he doesn't have like sea bag or something to boost his MA up a little bit more, but I understand why the Mace of Zeus. Okay, so Vanvalet, we got Dallas the Ninja. This is this is uh, his hers band of ninja, um, Cooper the ninja, Eric the ninja, and finally Kelly the ninja. Uh, to briefly go over this team, Idabot ninja with the don't act don't move proc combo with elf mantle with some degree of evasion. This is a bruiser ninja with scorpion tail ninja knife to attack up warpath with 12 pa. That's gonna hurt. Our protect so he can at least counter. Um, Whatever incoming attack that may come in, actually that might come in handy against this particular time mage here as he has best compat with her oh wow this ninja is going to be able to one shot three of these ladies here I just noticed it and he's going to um, hurt these ladies pretty badly as well oh wait they're all Pisces huh and she only has worse compat with these three Pisces Virgo I just noticed that okay uh, Iga Koga Ninja with a 12 PA attack up. That's also going to hurt. Especially these three ladies, considering, you know, best compat means they're all dead. This one can, um, resist the Iga Koga combo. But with attack up, that's still going to rather hurt. This is just the, um, White Magic, uh, Ninja with a short edge. That way, the short edge should oil hit. That means he can punch through all that damage. Oh boy, oh boy. Okay, so with all that said, uh, Soundcast would be in trouble if if these ninjas are in close range. With that said, we'll be going to map 21, uh, Zatania Castle's War Room. Good luck to the both of you. If that time mage can charm one of the male ninjas for Soundcaster, I think Soundcaster will definitely win. Like, there's almost no question about it. Sure, he can cause him poison off the bat. Regen will, will fix that, though. <clears throat> Lei Lonai will go forward. Let's see what she's going for. Maybe a slow to... Oh, yeah, she has summon magic, so she's going to... Do all sorts of stuff. Cover fire. Ouch. That really hurt. All right, Kelly will go forward and go for Regent herself. Make sure everyone stays afloat. Paul will go forward and he's probably going to go for a Cure 3, it looks like. Yes, Cure 3. And let's see. Looks to be a slow 2. Yes, a slow 2 is going to happen. Catches all the ninjas. Here's Odin. Didn't kill anybody. 
damage split, though. However, slow will help Soundcaster out quite a bit, as well as don't move if, if, this, if this can actually land. There's a combo that will finish off one of the ninjas for sure. Oh, Salamander's coming up. That's right, the Time Age of Salamander. And a stop rock. Dallas will go forward and... Oh, don't move, Proc. Yeah, with the ninjas being slowed, um... Yeah, one got stopped. Eric will go forward and come fire. Killed only one of the time mages. The female ninja is stopped. Now the other one stopped. Yeah, that's, those slows on the ninjas are gonna really hurt Vanvalet here. Soundcaster is showing off the speed advantage right here. See your accessory right there? That might have been the protect, uh, the one with the, with the church. And see accessory again, just to be a little bit annoying. Stop is gonna finally wear off. There's a dual wielding time mage. Yeah, Soundcaster is showing that time mages can outdo ninjas. How about that? Double block. Nice. See, don't move. Uh, doesn't hit anybody. Here's Odin, though. Uh, kills that ninja. So, this should be it, like, really soon. Alright, Comet's coming up, and Paul will go for a slow two. Alright, the Ninja will be looking for a raise one. Again, I don't think... Again, uh, because the, sl the slow two hitting everyone... Vanvalet might have, I think, Vanvalet just lost this one. That slow really gave Soundcaster the edge he absolutely needed to win. And yeah, that's pretty much it. Soundcaster takes round one. We shall, we shall see what happens in round two. Okay, so round two is about to begin. As we are now in map nine, the Citadel of Egros Castle. Um, I find it interesting that in the game, um, in 1.40a uh, anyways, unless that would always have been like this, map nine was considered to be a medium map, but this looks a lot like a large map to me. Like, maybe, uh, for 1.41, when that comes out, um, Genji should label map 9 as a large map, because this looks a lot like a large map to me, the way the units are positioned. Um, j j just a quick, just a quick, um, heads up. That all. Alright, so as we saw last match, uh, Soundcaster with that slow 2 really crippled Vanvalet's, uh, ninjas. If slow two hits again, I think I'm gonna call it GG. Alright, Diana will go for I'm not sure what she's going for as of yet. But yeah, the ninjas really never got in range to do something. Alright, Jasmine look for a comet. Paul is still out of range. Comet, and there's a stop, which does connect. Alright, Dallas should probably remove a yes he will with the Chronos tier. Leilani and I will go for Odin here. Diana will once again look for the stop proc. Kelly is gonna stay out of range. Just gonna go for a wall. Make sure the ninja stays protected. Let's see, 
There's a stop once again, catching both ninjas this time. Ouch. Best compat also means that the duo and time mate. Oh, Death Brock from Odin. Yeah, Soundcaster is just on a major roll right now. Stop gets blocked because of the elf mantle. But even so, this is Soundcaster's game already. Even without the slow two. Alright, only one kill that time. Can Eric actually do something? Yes, he can. Ouch! That's a one-hit KO right there. There's a slow two. Misses when we... This time when we catch his two ninjas. I don't know. Soundcaster, I think is still... I still think it's going to take this because... Ninjas lack AoE. Ninjas lack the HP to actually survive the AoE. Not only that, but they but they also um, are slowed too, which really helps Soundcaster in the long run. Double kill Odin right there. Yeah, that ninja can't move, so she's got stopped as a result. Alright, and Dallas will only get the don't move proc. That repel knife proc would have been pretty nice, but unfortunately, that wouldn't I don't think that would have changed that much of a difference anyways. Double miss right there. And St. Cole just to cancel the raise uh, one spell. Don't move. So yeah, this is gonna be GG right here. No oh, auto shoot goes off. Uh, Dallas can't get a turn, but I don't think that um that's gonna matter too much. It's, it's just gonna be a matter of when Soundcast is gonna finally be able to finish him off. There's Salamander. Had just only one ninja. Bam. Yeah, not much else to say here except, uh, yeah. Soundcaster, you'll definitely be moving on to round three. Vanvalet, uh, an early thanks for playing. <laughs> nice. Nine damage bag whack. Just enough to finish her off, too. Carbuncle, just because, and stop, 50-50 shot. The redirecting didn't even matter. Um, even if, if that were the hit, uh, there's no way Soundcast would be losing this one. Bonk. Critical bonk. Slow two, and now this is the end. Bonk. Alright, well, that's it for match 12, guys. Uh, GG Vanvalet, 
and congrats, Soundcaster. 